Good morning, travelers. It is another wonderful day here in Costa Rica. Uh, we are gonna be heading out shortly to go get our COVID test so that we can get back into the US as our trip is starting to come to an end. So we're gonna get started with that and then hopefully we can check out one of the trails kind of around our Airbnb here. Wait, I think I'm missing part of the... <laughs> Maybe I don't know how to use a hammock. We just got our COVID test so that we can go back home. It's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> it really just made me cough. And I think it actually made me cry a lot. <laughs> it was a little too tingly way up the nose for her. So we just drove back to our Airbnb to find out that there was some power outage. So the gate, in order to get in, it's not opening um, so we're waiting for them to fix it in order to let us in but yeah there's no power my guess it has to do with the construction over here um, so we'll keep you posted if we can get back into our Airbnb So it's only supposed to rain, or not rain, for like three hours today. And this is gonna be like part of that time. <laughs> so hopefully they figure out this gate quick. There was apparently some sort of hiking trail somewhat near our Airbnb. So we're hoping they can get this sorted out quickly so that we can uh, maybe do that before it rains. Well, the gate's gonna stay broken, I guess. And we're walking in now instead. And we'll have to carry all our suitcases down. So, not only is the gate power out, but so is all of the power in our Airbnb, which means we have no internet, which means we can't find where the trail is. So we're gonna wait here and hope that the internet oh comes back. God. I don't know. The internet didn't come back. Yeah, so power is still gone and our car is down the hill. So we're walking everything to the car. <laughs> and we didn't pack light. <laughs> managed to get everything back in the trunk <laughs> and down the hill so time to figure out where we're going <laughs> so we got to go find a restaurant with some sort of wi-fi so that we can figure out where we're going next We just had breakfast. It was really good. We found a spot that had Wi-Fi. It allowed us to do like the little research that we needed to confirm our hotel for tonight. And we did a little drive there. It was less than an hour. And we finally made it to La Fortuna where we're gonna be staying the night. <laughs> So we just arrived at Arenal Volcan National Park. So it's the Arenal Volcano right here, just outside of La Fortuna. Victoria's just finishing getting her shoes on. And we're gonna go explore some of the hiking trails here. Struggling. <laughs> Struggle's real? Yes. But look at this, backed in parking. Wow. Victoria hates backing in for parking. I mean, there's it, it was a fairly big spot, but I still think she did a great job. <laughs> <laughs> He's just saying that because he made fun of me <laughs> earlier. And she still can't get her shoes on. <laughs> <laughs> I refuse to untie them. <laughs> <laughs>
actually pretty nice. Um, it was just a little warm. But, oh yeah, very humid. <laughs> but like there was like a lot of wildlife as you were walking, so it was kind of cool. Mostly insects, so they were really hard for us to try to capture. I think I got a couple of shots of them, but yeah, so all of these rocks around us were formed during the last eruption in 1991, and they all came from right up there at the Arno volcano. And behind us, there was some great views of the lake, which right now it's starting to get a little bit overcast, but I took some like just a second ago, so you'll see those too. So our volcano view is gone. That's and gone. <laughs> that view is gone, and I'm pretty sure those storm clouds are headed this way. So let's go down so we don't get caught on the rain again. <laughs> again. So we're walking, and Victoria's fixing the bag while walking. <laughs> Multitasking. So everything should be set in the event that it does rain on us. It looks like it's gonna hold off, but. We figured better safe than sorry, we're just gonna have this one camera out, so all we have to do is throw it in the bag and throw the rain jackets on top in the event that we get rained on. <laughs> back to the car we are back on the road as you can see and we have to drive past one of our favorite dinner spots in La Fortuna on the way back to our hotel so we figured we're gonna see if La Fortuna pub is actually open I think it might be because it's a weekend I know when we were here in February during the week they didn't open until I think four or five so Hopefully it's open, fingers crossed. It looks like La Fortuna pub is actually open. The bad news is that it's pouring. So we're gonna wait a few minutes and then just run it. So the food came. It's Victoria's favorite wings, possibly in the world. I don't know, she'll tell you if it's her favorite in the world. They are the best. If you are in the area, I highly recommend them, so just stop by and have some food. So after a wonderful dinner, as always, at La Fortuna Pub, we are back at our room. But that does wrap up our day today here in La Fortuna. We hope you enjoyed watching it and we hope you enjoy following along. If you do, be sure to hit like on this video. It does help our channel out a lot and subscribe to see our future adventures. And we'll see you all in our next cave. Bye-bye, everyone. everyone.